Oh, so you thought you can get away with stealing money from your landlord? Nah, -uh! eviction day is here, son. I don't feel bad on eviction day because I hate people who act like they're the victim of the problem they created. How do I sleep at night knowing I just evicted a single mother? Like a freaking baby. Stop being a little sissy boy and work harder. Stop living beyond your means. Don't forget to tip your landlord this holiday season. Don't want to see you get evicted or nothing. Despite the fact that we're out there doing the Lord's work, your landlord is not actually Jesus. I won't stop till I hear him say. Tell me I'm wrong. Inflation isn't why you couldn't afford your house and you got yourself evicted. You got evicted because you're lazy, entitled, and afraid to put in a hard day's work. A lot of tenants think they can get away with not paying their rent to the landlord. Nah, man, that ain't how it goes in this game. If you don't pay your rent, you're getting evicted. There ain't nothing you can do to stop the eviction. All the woke winky wankers out there wondering how we end the eviction crisis. Ending the eviction crisis is the simplest thing in the world. Pay your rent. If you don't, you gotta go, bro. How do I sleep at night knowing I just evicted a single mother? Like a freaking baby. The fact of the matter is, if you don't pay rent, that's stealing. How does a police officer feel when they arrest a single mother for robbing someone? Because if you don't pay your rent, you're robbing your landlord. Oh, so you thought you can get away with stealing money from your landlord? Nah, -uh! eviction day is here, son. I bet you're crap in your pants knowing the landlord's coming in and everything you own is going in the trash. Tell me I'm wrong. If I were getting evicted today, I wouldn't cry and blame my landlord. I'd realize I'm a piece of crap and I need to change my life. Don't forget to tip your landlord this holiday season. Don't want to see you get evicted or nothing. A lot of people like to compare landlords to Jesus. Sure, we looked the part. Sure, we're true American heroes. But I assure you, despite the fact that we're out there doing the Lord's work, your landlord is not actually Jesus. I always get these dudes asking me how they stop their eviction. I always tell them the first thing I would do is stand up to pee. Tell me I'm wrong. Young men are being evicted at an epidemic rate because society has emasculated them. We get a lot of comments on our videos from people complaining that the rent is too damn high. Enough of the victim mentality already. Stop being a little sissy boy and work harder. Stop living beyond your means. Stop wasting your money on DoorDash. Start budgeting your money appropriately. If you do all that, you're going to do just fine. Look at your landlord. He does it and he's crushing it. I don't feel bad on eviction day because I hate people who act like they're the victim of the problem they created. It breaks my heart having to evict kids from their homes because their parents are irresponsible pieces of crap. Time and time again, we're throwing out a family who just spent their rent money on a brand new big screen TV. How incredibly bad do you have to be at raising a child that you lost your child's home because you spent your rent money on a freaking TV? Tell me I'm wrong. We don't have an eviction crisis. There is no housing crisis. The rent isn't too damn high. We have a crisis of lazy young soy boys who don't want to work anymore. I have to laugh at all the stupid marks out there who are so offended by these landlord videos. Like, bro, you are flipping your lid calling me a horrible person because I said adults need to have jobs and adults can't steal from other people. What is wrong with you, dude? Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.